Good evening, ladies. Well, here I am um, to tell you a story about men. We all know they're dogs, right? Right. So, I'm actually here to tell you that there's this really cool invention that we've got now, and um, I think you'll really benefit from it. Imagine a guy who will do anything for you. When you clap, he comes to you. When you whistle, he'll jump all over you. I mean, it's amazing. Although you do have to feed them because they're on all fours. <laughs> all fours. Imagine a man on all fours. Running to your beck and call. I, I got one right now so, so I can show you what the whole deal is, okay? Yeah, puppy, 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 puppy. Oh, puppy. Hi, my baby. Oh, look at he's kissing my feet. Licking my feet. Oh, keep on doing it, baby. Oh. Okay, stop. That's enough. All right. It's great. He'll do whatever you want. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Um. I'll tell him to roll over. Roll over. Okay, roll back. <laughs> it's marvelous, don't you think? All right. Now, even if I step on him and I go like this, and I just go like this, and I beat him up, and, and I go like this, and he doesn't even care because he's my puppy, whoopy, puppy. It's so great. I mean, don't you wish you could have one of these? Mm -hmm. Um. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Let me have him beg first. Beg. Mm. Beg. Mm. Oh. Mm. <laughs> He's begging me. Mm. Begging. Mm. Uh, okay, okay, stop. That's enough. Gosh. And, and see, when it gets on your nerves, you can make him stop whenever you want. Okay. <clears throat> Check this out. I can whip him as hard as I want. As long as I want. And he won't even care. Come here. Yeah, this is my little puppy. Oh, it's my little puppy. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Imagine a guy who's going to do whatever you want, when you want. <sighs> it's fantastic. But there is one problem, like I said. Um, you do have to feed him because obviously they're on all fours. But it doesn't... No, shh. No, I'm not going to feed you. No. <sighs> no, no, no. Now, now, play dead again. <laughs> it's amazing. You've got to get one. Um, but you do have to potty train them, you know, or else they'll piss all over the place. Um, but that's about it. If you want a man to do whatever you want, when you want, get a man on all fours. It works every time. Mm -hmm. Bye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can go on a vacation. Oh, I can do a lot. I'm really starting to think twice about selling this bike. Mm. Maybe I'll call Mike and do a call and tell him that maybe I'm, I will sell it. I'm ready to give me a bunch. Maybe seven hundred dollars or something. this bike. Oh, Mike told me I can get $30,000 for this bike. Maybe I will. This is a Schwinn Deluxe Twin. $30,000. You're watching the Tony D Show, so don't change that channel. You're watching the main again, the ultimate in entertainment, as far as finding who has made it on television next. It's time to mate on TV, so don't hesitate, participate. Hi, I'm Veronica, and I'm looking for a man who knows how to dance, who knows how to dress, and how to treat me right. Mia and I'm here to find me a man that I can take home.
come to mind by that. Hi, my name's Lisa, and I'm from Connecticut. And I'm looking for a guy that can paint a house in one night and take me out to dinner. <laughs> hey, I'm looking for uh, a woman who uh, I've never met before, who will give me the time of my life, and to love <laughs> to experience life, because, you know, we're all going to die. So let's party on. Yeah, because I just want to have a good time. And I, I'm not trying to beat the corner or anything. I've been to a lot of clubs. I've been having a lot of hard times. So that's why I'm on the show. I just want a girl who wants to have a good time. <laughs> going to all the bars, and I haven't had a girl yet. And I'm just trying to, to, to get a girl and have a great time, you know? And it's just about time that I had a girl tonight. I can't wait to pick. Um, number one. Um, since you like nudity, uh, do you prefer rated X, rated R, or rated G movies? Actually, and why? And why? Oh, I actually like rated G movies because, well, they're so romantic and sweet, and I don't like rated X movies. I, I didn't never said I liked nudity. I just said that I maybe would. Excuse me. If I was maybe, I would play Twister, but I just said maybe. I don't like nudity. I don't, Mom, I don't. I don't like nudity. I don't. I, what was the question? I uh, just, uh, what do you prefer, rated X, rated R, or rated PG? <laughs> Testing number two. Yes. If you are in a situation uh, between Chinese, uh, pizza. Salted, I, I, I don't eat red meat. Oh, okay. So. Good, vegetarian. Yes. But. I eat some meat, but not all. Oh. I'm sure you do. Mm -hmm. Great, thank you, contestant number two. Contestant number three, um, if you were on a date, would you give the guy the first kiss or would you let him kiss you? Um, well, it depends on the moment. Um, it could probably either go either way. Contestant number one, um, what would you do if um, you had a selection between foods, do you, exp uh, do you take burger joints, mm -hmm. do you take uh, Chinese food, or do you take uh, Italian food? What do you prefer? Oh, I really like Italian food, so that's mostly what I would be eating, because I like spaghetti and I like pizza. Uh, I also um, I like that Italian ice cream. And also, okay, if you take me to an Italian restaurant, I also want breadsticks and the wine, because they have really good breadsticks and wine. Um, did you know that uh, Italian restaurant over there on Sunset? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the one I want to go to, because the, the pasta is unbelievable. And they also have, um, what, um, yeah, I like the pizza, and I like the pasta, and I like the breadsticks, and I like the wine, and I like, um, I think that's about it. I don't eat that much. <laughs> Contestant number two, if you were on a um, boat trip, would you, uh, what would you do during the cruise? Would you um, go hanging out at the pool? Would you go dancing? Or would you um, just sit around and lounge and get a tan? Well, I'm a pretty outdoorsy type of girl. So I would definitely be out dancing, you know, I don't know, do different things and spontaneous stuff. You know, I like men that are spontaneous, so I would definitely do a little bit of everything. Oh, good. Yeah. Good answer. Uh, contestant Thank number you. three. Um, if you were to go um, on an outdoors event, uh, do you prefer hunting? Do you prefer water skiing? Or do you prefer um, just going ahead and going to a theme park? Hunting water, that's a hard decision there. So actually, I probably want to do all three of them. But um, probably, uh, most likely, a theme park. <laughs> Contestant number two. Yes. Um, what do you clarify as a good time? Clarify? I can tell you what she thinks is a good you time. You don't know what I mean. Um, as a good time, I guess it could be a lot of things. It could be... Um, Something simple like going out to dinner and having great conversation, or something wild like going skinny dipping and you know, just anything. Skinny dipping with clothes or without clothes? Hello, skinny dipping. Oh, okay. So nude, I presume. Yes. Uh, yeah. In the ocean or in a lake? Does it matter? We're gonna be naked. Oh, <gasps> what? Okay. Uh, thanks. Thanks, uh, contestant number two. Contestant number three. Yeah. Um. What would you consider to have a good time? Um, running on the beach, 
Um, Nude or? <laughs> um, <laughs> I got you. Yeah, if it was in the middle of nowhere, probably. That'd be kind of interesting experience. Um, probably jumping out in the middle of the ocean, too, <laughs> jumping off the boat. Uh, um, what else? Um, skydiving. Um, geez. That's, that's exciting as it gets, huh? Skydiving. Right. All right. So, uh, all right, I'm going to make my pick, everybody. And I pick contestant. All right, one more question before I pick. Contestant number one, um, what would be the most ideal date for you? Huh? Contestant <laughs> number one, what would be the most ideal date for you? Making bracelets. Making bracelets. Uh -huh. Okay. Contestant number two, what would you consider to be the ultimate date? Um, the ultimate date. Um, wow. Um, um, I guess if I were drunk, the ultimate date would be being drunk. Cool. Great. Uh, test number three, what would you consider to be the ultimate date? <laughs> the ultimate date? Um, just sharing life together, being yourself, uh, loving one another. That would be the ultimate date. Orgies. Great. Like <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Um, let me go ahead. Number, number one, um, I think because she was a little bit uh, scary. Um, the reason why is because uh, the twister was a little bit, um, it was a question that I think that's a little bit uh, inhumane. Um, number two, she was a little bit conservative. She was a little bit too demanding. I'm afraid of women who like to control too much. Be a man! Uh, number three, I select number three because she likes to run nude on beaches. Yeah! yeah. So, yeah. so number one, I'm ready to meet you. Oh my god. I'll see you after this show. Oh my god! Oh my god! Why did I pick him? I should have picked it! Holy cow! Oh no! Come back! Number two, where are you at? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, sorry, thank you. Number three, where are you at? Oh my god! Oh, we got a trip to Aruba! Ah! We're going to be in, uh, in uh, Aruba this week, and uh, thank you, everybody. Where's my money? Trouble, buddy. Well, come on. You're gonna get it. Yeah. She all right? Yeah. Cut. Cut right here. Oh! 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 So what to do? 
快点吧！哎呀，哎，我们就这样，我们啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊啊This is rehearsal. Well, I'm asking. Yeah. Okay, okay, where's Mike? Okay, ready? Action. And you want to say something? Wait. Just fucking. Say, hey, what's up, guys? Come on, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Ready? Action. How are you girls doing? Okay. Uh, hi. Okay, where's my cheese? Well, what cheese? I said, where's my cheese? <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's good you did that. It's good. It's good for her because that's a good How are you girls doing? Okay. What's up? Where's my cheese? Ah, uh, I don't know. Hey, you guys keep us doing. Good. Where's my cheese? Um, we don't, we don't have any cheese. cheese for you. Sorry. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> What's going on here? What the hell is going on here? Who are you? You don't even know who I am. Yeah, you're in trouble, buddy. Come on. You're gonna get it. You alright? Are you guys alright? You guys alright? Come on here. Oh my goodness. I've been seeing you. Yeah. Okay. Hey, you alright? Oh my god, I gotta call M1. You okay? Wake up, wake up! Shit, it caused eternal damages here. Oh shoot, what's gonna go happen now? You guys, wake up! Oh. Wake up, I say! Shoot. I knew this guy was You guys all right? Yeah. You guys okay? I think so. You guys were awoken by the spirit of the flu. I had to wake you guys up because you were attacked by the miserable Dan Quixote mustache. He wanted his cheese and you guys should have gave it to him. Never take his cheese. It's rotten anyways. We didn't mean to. No, never take his cheese because he'll do anything to get his it cheese. It was an accident. Do you understand? He's a rat. You can never talk to him. You have to stay away. You have to go see Ambrose immediately. Okay. Ambrose is going to be very Wait, upset. Sharice Sharice is missing. Yeah. Sharice? You don't know where Sharice is. Where'd she go? I don't know. She's supposed to be in the bathroom. bathroom. Come well, on, you guys. Follow me. I think I know she's in the woods. Come on, follow. Come on. Whistle! 
cold in there. I don't think she reads the newspaper. Hurry, come on. I don't hear her and I'll see her. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Don't be afraid. Chuck, put your toes on. Put your, put your toes on this golden stone. There you go. There you go. All right, let's find some balance. Ancient river. Okay. Cross it. This ancient bridge. Oh, Watch out, this corona. Oh, oh! oh. oh. I grabbed luck. You never do that. All right, you call the Coast Guard, you call the Marines, yes. and I'll call the FBI. Okay. Right, you got to find her. We do. If we not, really I'm going to have to play the magic flute. When you play it really quick, so good luck. You guys ready? Let's play. Let's play. 